This is a quick demonstration of EMC Solera's new production dedupe capability. Solera dedupe is a function that you can simply enable for any file system. It's supported on the new uh, EMC Solera's as well as uh, any Solera uh, system that's been purchased in the last few years can simply update the latest version of Dart and get this feature. You can see here that in the simple GUI, all you need to do is enable this deduplication feature. Um, it can be applied to any file system, uh, so there's no restriction on the uh, Solera file system size. Um, and no uh, um, uh, restriction on uh, Solera snapshot or replication behavior. So as an example here, we've got a file system that's been um, uh, pre-created. I've created one here that's relatively small, just so that the effect of uh, the uh, deduplication process can be seen very, very quickly. Um, if you take a look at this uh, within the traditional uh, Windows uh, Windows Explorer GUI, you can see here that this file system, in this case a SIF share, um, is relatively uh, full. It's about half full. In this case, it's filled with all sorts of files. So this uh, Solera dedupe uh, capability applies very broadly to uh, uh, general purpose NAS use cases. Um, you know, they can be uh, all files of all types that you would put onto either a SIFS or an NFS uh, uh, device. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to that uh, file system that was created without data deduplication and enable data dedupe. So if we navigate down to properties, you can see that a file system that, uh, for example, may have been created before you update to the latest version of Dart uh, that doesn't have this feature on, all you need to do is go to properties, go to de deduplication, and say on. Um, what starts to happen is that uh, the dedupe process starts to analyze files looking for a good uh, data reduction candidates. Um, eliminates files that are identical, and then also applies compression techniques, very, very rapid uh, compression techniques. So don't think of this as like a WinZip. Um, it's basically transparent to the end user um, during both the uh, compression and the decompression process. And after just a few minutes here with this relatively fa small file system, with a larger multi-terabyte file system, it would take a little bit longer for this effect to be seen. Um, you can see that we've basically uh, saved roughly 36% of the original size of the file system. Um, so, uh, you know, an immediate benefit, a very low performance impact, um, and uh, our expectation is that most customers are going to uh, enable this feature as a as a general uh, as a general statement. Um, it shouldn't be used on file systems, for example, that are hosting uh, Oracle on NFS. Um, you know, something that has an extremely high performance workload. Um, but for general purpose NAS use cases, uh, it uh, really will provide the greatest uh, efficiency and deduplication that you'll see on the market. And you can see that visually here. Uh, remember, this file system was roughly uh, half full beforehand, and now we've essentially reclaimed almost, uh, uh, almost half. Uh, simple, easy, built into the GUI and has uh, uh, no effect on file system size, snapshot capabilities, and can be used uh, relatively broadly. Uh, thanks very much, and uh, have a great day.